Okay, hello class. Today I'm going to be giving you instructions on how to complete your homework assignment for the second day. So um, it says type each column three times perfect. So you have the English on the left column, the steno on the right column. That's what your notes should look like. So three times perfect. So I'm going to write zoo, um, split, mood, joined, ploy, things, groom, groin, quick, scrawl, much, heart. So let's check it. Just click over where you started. And so we see over here, zoo, split, mood, joined. I'm looking at my sheet as well. Ploy, things, groom, groin, quick, look at the steno, scrawl, much, heart. Perfect. So I have one perfect column. So now I'm gonna hit PF and go on again. So we have zoo, split, mood, join, ploy, things, groom, groin, quick, scrawl, much, heart. Check it. I put a period, but we wouldn't count off. So you have zoo, split, mood, join, ploy, things, groom, groin, quick, scrawl, much, heart. Perfect. So one more time, okay? Take your time, complete extras. So we have zoo, split, mood, join, ploy, things, groom, groin, quick, scrawl, much, heart. Check it, okay? So we have zoo, split, mood, join, ploy, things, groom, groin, quick, scrawl, much, heart. Perfect. So you have three perfect rows. So you're gonna go to the next one now. So you'll write spouse through louse, Three times perfect each column. If you make a mistake in the middle, you have to start at the very beginning. Then blotch through noise, small through flood. Okay? And then um, make sure you take your time. And then it says type the following one time perfect with the correct steno. So just one time perfect each sentence. So you have her young son had a brooding look, period. So let's check it. Her young son had a brooding look. Look at the steno outline. Her young son had a brooding look. Perfect. Go to the next sentence, okay? You have the steno outline there, and you're going to have 10 sentences. Perfect. So 10 perfect sentences. And then we've got um, type the following groups twice perfect each column. So uh, child bride. These are incorporating your long vowels. Child bride. Uh, blood cell. Uh, bleed in heart, tight knot, drove home, school year. Check it. And so I'm going to go child bride. It starts right here. Child bride, uh, blood cell, bleeding heart. Perfect. Look at your steno. Tight knot, drove home. And then you've got school year. Perfect. So I'm going to do it one more time. Okay. PF, child bride, blood cell, bleeding heart, tight knot, drove home, school year. Perfect. So let's check it. Child bride, blood cell, look at your notes, um, bleeding heart, tight knot, drove home, school year. Perfect. So it's all perfect. So we'll go to the next column. So it'll be seek proof through take place, keep pace through quite nice, pet peeve through fruit juice. You have the steno outlines there. So take your time, check your work, twice perfect each column. If you make a mistake anywhere, you start over at that beginning of the column because you want to have three perfect columns, okay? And then we'll go on and it's three homework sheets. Uh, type the following twice perfect. So we've got each sentence twice perfect. So I'm going to start PF. And so the groom will wed the bride now, period. So let's check it. Go click it. So you have your steno. You can look at it. The groom will wed the bride now, period. Perfect. So one more time, okay? Because it's each sentence twice perfect. So I have the groom will wed the bride now, period. Check it. And... The groom, check your steno, will wed the bride now, period. Perfect. Each sentence twice perfect. You have uh, your steno outline there, so make sure you take your time. And uh, let me know if you have any questions, okay?
Remember, perfection is what we are looking for. Very, very important that you get it perfect, okay? Have a great day, you all.